All right. So, yeah, I, as you already know, we had this Dell laptop with a charging port issue, which it was like broken inside. Uh, you can see that in the previous video. And after I replaced this port, the battery didn't charge. I assumed that is a problem with the battery, but actually it wasn't because I measured the port and it, the, the, the voltage, it wasn't right. Um, then I did some diagnostics. Basically, I measured some components, power supply on the battery here, on the battery circuit, and I've noticed that we have a MOSFET here, this little guy, that it, it didn't give 8 volt to the pins for the battery. And yeah. Now I fix it, I already fixed it, and I'm sorry I couldn't record the video at that time. Basically what I've done, I've replaced this MOSFET. It was this MOSFET, which it was faulty, it was closed. It didn't give any output to the battery. And after that, I got the right voltage. I got on the output pins, I got the 8 volt. So the battery now is charging perfectly. Um, with the multimeter, what I've done, in order to diagnose this, I put on voltmeter, volt, ground, and on the output, I put it like, like this, on any pin, because all four, they are together. And here, it was zero, you know? Now we just get seven volt from the battery. If I get like that, it will be zero, yeah? Of course, it's still some current inside. One volt, and it's going down. It just uh, was... Just plug it in. Yeah, it will go to zero anyway. So at that time, with this MOSFET, when I plugged in the power, power cable, the voltage here, it was zero. Now you see, we have 13 volt, which this is the right amount to be. And if I plug in the battery, let's see, it have eight volt taking yeah 8 volt 8.1 so yeah this was the issue i'm just going to show you under the microscope just for you to make an idea if you have this issue to find the problem easily so yeah this is the battery connector yeah and this is the mosfet this was the mo faulty mosfet it's an n channel mosfet and you see all four pins, they are together, these four pins. So yeah, I measured here, was zero. I replaced it with a good one. Now we get 13 volts. With the battery connected, we get eight volt, which is normal. So yeah, that's it. I hope everyone is learning something from this uh, video and have a great day.